Today I'm uh, with and would you state your name? Melissa Fletcher. Uh, and you're going to have to talk out, up a little bit, Ms. Fletcher. We're standing up in, out in front of the uh, Dale County Board of Education meeting uh, What on September the 12th, 2013. What time is it? 5.39. Okay, and there was a school board meeting. What was your understanding was the school board meeting time? About 5.30. Okay, and what time did you get here? About like 5.15. All right, and you asked to speak to the board. Yes. And what were you told? I have to we get on the agenda for next month. So I couldn't speak at this meeting. Okay. What was it you wanted to talk to the board about? My son. And your son is how old? Six. What school does he go to? Millen City Elementary. All right. What is the reason you want to talk to the board? Uh, for discrimination. My, my son got suspended today for wearing clear plastic earrings to school. Okay. Had you been told for him not to wear the earrings? Well, he called me Friday, Mr. Parker, and said that and Mr. Parker is who? the principal. Okay. And, and he called you and said what? For me to come take his earrings out or either pick him up. So I went and picked my son up. And I, I said about the school, and I'll see other kids at the school wearing earrings, other little boys, but it's okay for them to wear earrings, but not my son. All right. And then what has led up to today's meeting? You're telling me your son is now suspended? Suspended for a month. Okay, and why for a month? They, they, they won't answer me. Okay, now who, who is they won't answer? The, Mr. Bynum and Mr. Parker. Okay, and they won't answer you and they told you he cannot come back to school for a month? Until the next board meeting in October. What's he supposed to do about his education? They don't care. Um, so they won't, they won't talk to you, nothing? I wrote a letter to Mr. Parker today, and I wrote a letter to the Title IX coordinator, which is the handbook said do, nothing's been done. All right. Why is it so important that your son wear earrings? It's a, girls can, boys should be able to. I mean, it's not, I mean, of importance, but it's discrimination. That's what it is. Okay. And have they said if you agree for your son not to wear the earrings, he could come to school, or they just said he's suspended? He's suspended until further notice is what I got. And I just got told it until the next board meeting, until I can get on their agenda. Do you have anything in writing that he is suspended? Yes, sir. Uh, and it says for until, how? Until further notice. Until further notice. Yes. All right. Do you have that with you? Yes, sir. Okay. I'd like to get that, but the board, so I've got this straight again. The Board of Education that deals in education, and the meeting was only nine minutes tonight. Yeah. They refused to allow you to speak. Yes, sir. Had you told them you were coming? Yes, sir. I talked to Miss Lisa this morning. Who's Miss Lisa? The one who answers the Board of Education phones. And what did she tell you? To be here at 530. Okay. And then who told you you couldn't speak? The meeting was pretty much adjourned by the time I, I mean, they, the sheriff's officer told me that I couldn't speak. Sheriff's officer yes. told you you yes. couldn't speak? Okay. I wasn't on their agenda. Okay. And who told you your son is still suspended? One of the board members until the next board meeting. Who was the board member, do you know? I don't know his name. Now, do you intend to tomorrow morning go ahead and carry your son to school for them to refuse him, or what do you intend to do? Talk to my lawyer. Okay. Are they giving you any justification why if you go ahead and carry the, would you be willing to leave the earrings out until the no. next board meeting? No, sir. Why not? It's, it is, it is discrimination. I know it's discrimination, but if, I'll pull my kids out of Dale County Schools and they will go to Dothan City Schools. Okay. So Dothan City Schools can wear earrings. Headland can, Op can, Geneva can. I've called every school around here. Okay. And it's prejudice, Mr. Barker. That's all it is. And he will not sit and talk with you? No, he told my husband to leave today. Is it in the handbook at the school? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, but he still won't discuss it? No, sir. Anything else you want to say? No, sir. Thank you.